What happens if you stop eating sugar? If one does not consume sugar for a week, the body can go through various changes. The most prominent change is the decrease of energy levels. For those who are accustomed to using sugar as their primary source of fuel, during the first few days, this lack of energy can be accompanied by headaches and fatigue as the body works to adjust to burning different kinds of fuels. As time goes on, the person's body will start to become more efficient at metabolizing fat and protein as a source of energy. This leads to an increase in energy levels, better mental clarity, improved concentration and focus, and an overall feeling of improved well-being. Additionally, blood sugar levels are likely to stabilize with fewer fluctuation when consuming less sugar, since sudden increases in blood glucose won't occur with low dietary intake of sugar this could lead to fewer cravings throughout the day. Since sudden spikes in blood sugar don't happen anymore, there might also be improvement in digestion, since eating too much sugar can cause dysbiosis within the gut microbiome, resulting in digestive issues such as bloating or feelings of being heavy after eating meals. On top of that, avoiding sugary snacks or beverages can also help to reduce calorie intake over time, leading to potential weight loss without having to make any drastic changes in diet or exercise habits. It can also reduce inflammation throughout the body, which can improve your overall physical performance. That was if you stop sugar for a week. But what if you went for about two weeks without sugar? Well, in two weeks, you can expect to see some major lifestyle changes. Your energy levels may become more stable as your body transitions away from the peaks and valleys associated with eating a sugary diet you will likely experience an overall decrease in fatigue and cravings for sweet food since your body is no longer dependent on them for quick boosts of energy. By this time, you will also see some more improvement in your digestive as well as immune system, and you may also see even more weight loss. By week two, your taste buds may also adjust to the lack of sugar. Over time, they will no longer expect an overall sweet flavor in all foods. This can lead to a greater appreciation of natural flavors found in fruits and vegetables that were previously masked by sweetness. Although, replacing desserts with healthier snacks like nuts or fruits might take some getting used to at first, you might start to gravitate towards these options as your palate adjusts. It is also not uncommon for people who cut out their sugar to also start reducing their intake of processed foods. They may begin to increase their consumption of fiber-rich whole grains and healthy fats. Over time, these dietary changes can result in numerous long-term health benefits and will improve your cholesterol level and your blood pressure, reducing the risk for diabetes. Now, what if you took this to one more level by not eating sugar for a month? If you decide to do this, you may experience some greatly noticeable changes in your body. By this time, your energy levels will feel more stable throughout the day. Additionally, you will also have lost a lot of weight due to the reduction of empty calories. On the mental side of things, cutting out your sugar for one month can reduce your cravings and lead to a better overall eating habit as well as increased awareness of what kind of foods to consume. Beyond just cutting out the empty calories, it will also reduce the risk of inflammation in your body. This is because when our bodies take in too much sugar at once, it triggers an inflammatory response that causes our blood vessels to constrict and increases our risk of developing heart disease and other cardiovascular issues. You will also see a decrease in your stress levels significantly as cutting out sugar will decrease your cortisol levels. Finally, cutting out added sugar from your diet can lead to overall skin health as well. Consuming sugary foods leads to an increase in acne due to increased levels of insulin, which triggers a high production rate of sebum, which is the oily substance that clogs pores. Therefore, reducing or eliminating added sugars will result in fewer breakouts on your skin over time. So all these factors make going without added sugars for at least one month an incredibly beneficial way to jumpstart healthier eating habits and see visible results within a relatively short amount of time compared to other dietary changes one can make. And that is what happens if you stop eating sugar for a month. If you find this video helpful and motivating, make sure you hit that like button and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring that notification bell. Stay healthy and thank you for watching.